Hello, Beef from the Plush here. Back with another video. Today we have a slight mini review, I would say, for the Five Nights at Freddy's Pop Pez Dispensers, a Christmas edition. Limited to 1,500 pieces, one of the rarest Funko FNAF items at the moment. Above other than, you know, Golden Freddy, that's a re release, but that's besides the point. So I'm just going to do a quick overview on these. Not go to too much detail, maybe, honestly. I'm not going to take them out of her box, considering these are highly expensive and highly rare. And also, two of these were bought by Moxie. The Freddy and Foxy were. Bonnie and Chica were bought by me. So without further ado, let's get into it. Alright, so putting Freddy over here, you have the Five Nights at Freddy's logo up here. Pop Pez, limited edition. Yeah, Five Nights at Freddy's, Snowflakes on top. Then you have the Snowflakes on top, the Pop Pez head, candy dispenser, Pop Pez candy dispenser, the Funko Christmas logo, limited to 1,500 pieces, Five Nights at Freddy's, Freddy, candy made in USA. Here is a closer look at the figure or Pez dispenser. You have Freddy Fazbear himself, just with the Christmasified or Jollyified. He has green and reds. His top hat has a green stripe with red candy cane patterns. Kind of hard to see, but it is in there. Then on the then on the side, you have more snowflakes, pop Pez. Here is the calories and all that. On the other side, you have more snowflakes. Goes all the way to the bottom with some candy canes on the bottom to continuing. Here is the bottom with the Funko code and the Funko websites. Yeah, let's basically get to the next one. Alright, next off here we have is Bonnie. Bonnie is exactly the same packaging as Freddy and the others. Except the only thing different about him is the name tag right here, Bonnie. Bonnie's logo right, not logo, face right here with the, you know, green Bonnie with the lights and stuff. And the figure inside is different too. So, basically what this figure is, well, yeah, let's just call it a figure. Red nose, red freckles. He has some red lights on there, mainly blue and yellow. For Christmas pattern, green and light, darker, darker green and lighter green. For the base color of the animatronic, then you have a sort of candy in here. Same same detailing as the others, so I'm not going to go into it. Limited to 1,500 pieces. I got this at Ralph Week's Fun Funhouse on eBay. Unsure if he still has it, but or they still have it because it's a company. But yeah, like it's nothing much, but it's still a really cool item and if you can get it in your collection. So out of the two streamer or Christmas lights, I have to say Chica's a little bit better than Bonnie. Honestly, because like she has a little bit more detail. But yeah, so Chica is on here with her. She's red instead of yellow. She has some green texturing, not texturing, detailing for the ribbons. It goes all the way around her head. It's kind of hard to see. I can't really, I don't want to open these, honestly. But like here is a side detailing. The other side detailing with the ribbon. And yeah, she has a yellow beak, white teeth, black inside the mouth, black around the eyes, white shine, not shine, white outlining, like how they did for original original pop. Which I'll probably bring in after this. The streamers have a light green and green, dark green, darker green. Like in the middle and on the sides or outlining it. Then for the actual Chica, she's actually made in red plastic, which is cool. Then she, all of them use this black base that says Pop Pez or just Pez. I don't really know exactly. I think it's just Pez. Yeah, it's just Pez. On the side here, here's another one for this side. But yeah, all the detailing is all the same on these. Sorry about I'm not opening these. It's just like I don't want to risk damaging these or... You know, worse, breaking the box, etc. I'm I'm not usually this type of collector. I usually take them out of box, but these things are super rare. 
as stated on the package, limited edition Funko, 1,500 pieces. All right, last up we have here is Foxy, probably the one of the more sought after ones, I would say. Because, like, and personally, in my opinion, him and Chica are probably the better ones, and Bonnie is, like, third, and Freddy's last. Or you can switch those around, it's really up to you. But yeah, we have Foxy. He's made in candy cane white. Sorry, this has so much hair and dust on it. But yeah, he is made in candy cane white, red, red stripes for candy canes, and he has another outlining for another for you know the mint around it. And you have a green eye patch for Foxy for his Christmas edition candy cane form version. Because there's a gingerbread, a nutcracker, and a candy cane from multiple different eras of FNAF. I think this is based off the pint size euro. I don't know, it's been a while since I've gone over that. Yeah, 1,500 pieces, Foxy. And then you have his glam shot up here. And then on the sides, you have more continuation of a candy cane. You have a circle around his ear with red and a more red outlining. Continuation of the eye patch. I don't know if it goes 360. Yeah, it goes 360 all the way around his head. And you have more red outlining. But yeah, let's compare these. Well, just Chica to her pop, and we'll go from there. All right, here is the Pop Pez packaging compared to the actual Funko Pop itself. These are my out of box pops that I have for Five Nights at Freddy's. I did not open any, so yeah. Here is Freddy original standard pop compared to his candy cane version for the Pop Pez. I forgot to mention earlier in this video that these are recolors of the original Pop Pez. Just repaints and remoldings. But yeah. Well, recolors. So yeah, let's get on to the next one for comparison. Alright, next off for comparison here is Bonnie. Just going to give you a few seconds to look at it. Alright, next off here we have is Chica. As you can see here, they both have the outlining on the eyes as I was talking about earlier. Then certainly the last but not least we have is Foxy. Alright, so if you were to buy these, how would I recommend you buying them? Foxy first, because he's the most different. Bonnie second, because he's a little bit more popular nowadays, especially after the Bonnie death and security breach, and his more idolization from the movie, and you know, Daco and all that stuff. Then we have Chica. I'd say Chica a little bit more, because she will be a little bit more rare, because she's less bought on, less bought by people. And she's, even though she's a decently simple recolor, she's not as simple as Bonnie. But Bonnie has more of a fan base than Chica. Then Freddy's last because he's just a simple basic recolor. Like, you can probably just get the average one and it shouldn't matter that much, honestly. Unless you want to collect all of these. I suggest picking this one up. But personally, I'm not a fan of a Freddy, honestly. That's just based on personal bias. But yeah. Alright everyone, so I want to thank you all so much for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe. I'll see you guys next time. Sorry for being gone so long. I don't know if I'm still going to display my FNAF yet. I'm in the process of thinking about it. But yeah, in the meantime, thank you all so much for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe. I really have to go somewhere in a few hours, so I should probably get to bed. So, but yeah, bye.